I know this is what you have I do not to want to die. Sighted sisters. <laughs> but is there no other way? No, otherwise I would not have done this. You knew what you signed up for, buddy. I don't know why. Actually, we don't know why they're complaining if they signed up for this shit. This is the protective transfer sequence, probably one of the most difficult and frustrating sequences in the game, if not the series as a whole. It's very, very annoying. See, there, these are level 1 enemies, so you can normally take them on on your own at this point. But because the transmitter is for real as a twig, you have to take matters into a different perspective or something. I'm using my thing behind that gate and it's able to go through. I think piercing shards and Tars Rage, the all one triangle attacks of uh, Spear of Destiny and Blades of Athena, respectively, can go through. But Maya the King is stronger and faster, so it's the better option. <laughs> he hit his friend. Great job, Seder. And you guys must be really intelligent. Speaking of that, Seders are actually kind of a problem as well. Because they can actually go through the gate. It's why you should keep the, the translator far back. They're, they are the only things that can go through this. Dogs and... The, the red and gold enemies can't go through. And I like letting the satyrs come in here so I can kill them with circle and also get health and experience. And Rage if I need it. And you know, the experience is just nice overall. Also, the Icarus attack can go through somehow. The only real benefit to probably using the Spirit of Destiny is maybe getting those extra matchups if you need it. Because we have a Vero wave coming up. You really shouldn't use anything else. Like, don't use your magic. Save it. I think there's nothing else that's going to come through. As far as I've noticed, the Barbarian Hammer itself can actually go through this. Like, the square attack can go through if they're really close. And the triangle overhead swing. I don't know if that L1 Spar attack can go through, but I just know it can go through. The Blades of Athena actually can't. And I don't think the uh, other attacks in Sphere of Destiny can't. Can. Besides their L1 triangle attacks. Like, I don't really know how it works, but I do actually wonder how else you would have to do this if. You couldn't use the key. I get to know your attacks can go through. If you need help with magic, as long as the transfer doesn't pass this, you can go back for it. I cannot read the words while they attack! Oh, I did not want to do that. Now make sure the enemies look. When, I, when, the, when I say enemies should not hit the transfer, I mean even through collisions. That will hit them. And that's the only attack Kratos does that can actually hurt them. Ooh. What the? Oh, God. What the? Oh, I can't jump. That's what that does. I've always wondered. Oof, I didn't want to do that. Ah, I just saw that the collision actually hurt the transmitter. That's the problem. And that does a lot on Titan. That actually... Oof, that could have... That could have screwed me over. Big time. And since I have no other enemies left, that would have been awful, but... I, I have that went kind of well. All of your magic works very well, but... Because of the collisions, Atlas Quake can backfire. Since it causes enemies to stagger and flop on the ground, it can backfire like that. And that would really be awful. I mean, Chronos Rage doesn't really hurt them. 
Hero's head actually wrecks this fight. If you have it maxed out, I probably should have in hindsight, but I didn't. Diamond's Bane doesn't really harm you, but it's not that useful, in my opinion. Unless you're trying to use its level up abilities to um, break the statues with a Hero's Gaze. But either way, that's actually surprisingly decent. That's still one of the hardest fights, and there's nothing else you can really do for that. Read it. Hear me, sisters who control the threads. Keep going. Another searches for what only the sisters may give. Read it. As proof that he is worthy. No, please, no. I cannot do it. I just love the real circle things here and there. It's just so funny the way he moves. Read accept this sacrifice of my blood. Well done, Maria. With this sacrifice, you have proven your resolve to seek out the sisters of fate. However, this is but a small step in your quest to gain an audience with us. Dude, you had a lot of blood, like, damn. Like, wow. That That's all I can say, like, wow. Anyway, there's not much I can really say there. Just, if you can, maybe max our real head. It's good for a few other fights as well. It's a decent ability. I just don't really use it, because... Why? I mean, it's great for satyrs, that's pretty much my main method of using it. You can actually make a checkpoint for the fight if you want, because you have to do it all in one sitting. You can't... If you die, you have to redo it the other ways. But, like, it's a technique using the barbarian hammer and then... Using circle here. And I kind of did it wrong, but it's, you have to be very quick when you unpause and after you ch switch to Spear of Destiny. Like, I can't do it personally. But it works, like, to explain, basically when you go through this gate, that's a checkpoint. But, if you don't, there's no checkpoint. You will get a checkpoint for when you are in the chamber with the translator. But that's about it. It's kind of hard to do, and I think it's a little tedious, but... Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's mostly if you want to practice it. Like, if you're, say, doing runs like I did. I have never done it, but I have seen it in action. I will link a video, maybe an annotation, also in the description. Still a couple of the ways you can do that fight. I kind of wish I didn't have Max on my Amphenos Pates and Max on my Rios hands that. We 
But you guys seem so fine about it before. Anyway, these are all level 1 enemies. To, there's not really going to be a problem here, but I prefer grabbing the smaller, dark enemies. The ones that kind of seems very zombie like. Although I think they're all undead. The parry actually works great. Right. I think it usually will instant kill all of them. A bunch. The main reason why I use the darker enemies is because they have that swinging arc, which is great. It's also actually a great area to get Titan Orbs if you need it, because if you kill them with it, I guess either I got all I think you still get some experience back. I can have always just remember that. It's not good. It's not really a problem this fight, honestly. Like, you have more time than you think you would. Because they won't automatically close it on Kratos, they'll linger and then they will kind of they'll swing, they'll close it on him. It's weird. Wait, wait. I see something there. I see you! Huh. I think that was a Rodian soldier somebody pointed out, actually. Is that we have some statues of the gods up there? Interesting. Kratos, you know not what you do. There are things far more important than your revenge. That's quite a bold statement, Athena. Zeus did what he must to protect Olympus. Gaia speaks nothing but half-truths and falsehoods. Basically the story of my life right there. <laughs> the Titans are not to be trusted. In you, Zeus feared the destruction of all he stands for. I'm just waiting to see if Vina actually says anything else. Interesting that you can't see her statue. And of course they wouldn't have a statue of Kratos. They would say Fallen God War, but they wouldn't have him there. But thanks for the experience. And we shall never speak of that again. Let's see. I think there's No, not there. Watch it. That would be bad if I just mashed R1. Right here. No. Now that soldier type guy we kept seeing, that was actually a Rodian soldier, apparently, as some of you have been telling me. Which is interesting. It's interesting that we're not alone, apparently. I've seen like a few people, like I think some random guard who tried to interfere with Kratos in Uriel's temple. But he, I think, got turned to stone or something. I don't know. People are weird in this game. Oh. Kind of forgot that was there. I can't get there clearly. That might have been wrong. Even though they just tried to kill me. So here we literally have to sacrifice these. I think these are Siren Widows actually. These ones will scream if left alone for long enough. Think about magic. Nice. I don't think we have anything else that kills them with fire. Not this game. You can just juggle them over and over. There's nothing else to really worry about. Ah, oh, I didn't want to do that. Of 
they're they fight pretty much similarly to the, like the other sirens in the little lands. So nothing to really worry about. And my battery is low, of course. I will fix that in a bit, actually. Kind of wish that didn't pop up. But oh well. That's their scream. If you just jump, you'll be fine. I love how they're always like in song when they get hit. Like, oh, I've been hurt. Oh, I must sing. <laughs> or something. So that was Vang, apparently. Got more awkward signs than this. Destroyed those bodies. I swear, if I you could. This guy I've heard see some of those obstacles, though. So watch it. Although I know you can destroy this, and I thought those things were not going to give me experience. I mean, worried there for a second. Pretty much we're in the last stretch, and that's what the games usually do to help you prepare for like the end game, final boss, etc. Alright, we've got a few things to do here first. Let's do this. Firing Falcon! <laughs> There's some. gonna use some of that and you can faintly see that some of these are covered in ice. I haven't seen or actually don't anything ice related to species actually. You can break all of these and you get experience. I think you have to destroy a few of them. I think this one. Yeah this one. I don't remember this puzzle entirely. That's kind of the one thing I always forget in the kind of games. Uh, let's see. We'll probably also destroy that one. We gotta find some way to make the. Hawk face that door. And to do that, we can have to basically unfight. Uh, what the? Glitched. Tara's rage attack, and I never really showed it off. It just takes too long and you're kind of open, that's the problem. That's the square attack, and that's what happens after you use, uh... When you use, when you press square after the creature's running, and then that's a triangle attack. It's kind of like to show that, but I figured I might as well show it at some point. <laughs> You know, it would be too easy. It can never be easy in this franchise. And I should not have come this way. I am totally smart. I Note to self, when I'm redoing a game for a Let's Play that I already walked through, remember not just the combat, but also the 
puzzles. Puzzles in the series usually aren't that bad. Or, in my opinion, tedious. Like, this one kind of is. Does this one destroy it? No, it doesn't. It actually, like, barely misses. So, we have to make this one face there. Let's do a little bit of turning, I think. Uh, bring that bronze. You can see a bronze ring down there. How many times? I think. Yeah, okay, that should do. Because you see it's kind of reflective. work? Yes, it does. Very nice. Probably should have turned it the other way. Alright, there we go. Now we can make this hog do whatever we want. And I do mean whatever we want. I don't know why there's this really dense, epic music, <laughs> but it's there. You might as well grab everything in here while you can. There would be nothing there. That probably would be meant to have maybe your last Phoenix feather, in my opinion. That's probably what it does. It's meant for that, which is. What's with the glitching graphics? Now, when I say you make the spirit do whatever you want, I do mean anything like, say, burning that Minotaur. Come here. What? You can you can block that? You can you can block that. What the hell is that? Yeah, it's supposed to kill me one strike, but the fuck? I never knew it didn't actually it block fire. Let the rage of the titans fire your blades, Kratos. The oh, fuck, man. There's also actually quite a bit of fire in such puzzles. Now I notice. 